Round two of the championship. Moved into the Forest of Dean for the Cotswolds Cup. Here's Robert on his new Yamaha. Just checking if David Rogers there put any fuel in it. Steve Saunders, a local boy, only lives a few miles down the road. And he'll be hoping for a great win here. Frantic importer, Mark Kicking, making one of his rare appearances at the British Championship. And Steve here, getting up a bit too early, I think, thinking he was at an indoor. First section here in the grounds of the start. Starless right here. Still feed up, that's unusual for me. Pressure's on with all the top boys watching me. And just taking a flying one there just before the ends cards. Dougie Lampkin leading the British Championship so far after the one round. Martin in the background, just checking him out. Good way to get the day on the way for Doug. Wayne there, just done a few tricks for us. Oh, pogo stick, I think. He looks in a confident mood. Nicely done. Graham here having a police escort up to the next group of sections. He's such a superstar. Steve just threading his way through the trees. Very difficult group of sections, this one. But no problems. Jerdy just taking a quick one. So it's very tight at the top there. As you can see, the sun was shining, but uh, a lot of rain pr prior to the event, making the conditions very slippery. Philip got his mudguard back on today. Taking a couple there. Not into all this trip riding is our Philip. That's okay. Great ride there from Graham. That's up in a very tricky part of the section. Not many done that all day. Jason Lawyer on his gas gas. He's having a great start to the season. Well up in the top ten all the time. Robert here just clouting his shoulder on the tree, knocking him off line. Steve Saunders there just showing how it should be done. This section probably one of the most spectacular of the trial. Flat out fourth gear climb. Let's just say if you didn't make it, you'd have a fair old crash. David Pye there, making easy work of it. Martin Richards getting it wound up. First lap I was riding very well, I was sort of 10 marks off Saunders. Um, 
I didn't throw a lot of silly marks away, you know, I was sort of using my marks as I could. Second lap, I've lost a few, I've had sort of five fives in a row which have spoiled it a little bit, but still riding good. And what do you think of the sections? The sections were very technical really, for the Cotswolds it's, it's not been the normal sort of, you know, get a go in straight sections, they've been very technical but they're still there to be ridden. Obviously, you know, it's, it's good to, to have a have a win. I mean, Dougie is riding very, very well at the moment. So, you know, just just beating him any time is is a good ride. So, I'm happy enough, and it's a good result to go to Cleveland with next week. Yeah, and do you like the Cleveland? Yeah, it's one of the best trials of the year. It's got to be. You know, just just hope that uh, the weather's quite reasonable. You know, it can be a horrible place up there if it's really wet and cold. So, I think it should be should be all right. Mm -hmm.